Hey everyone, Greg Corson here with a quick tip on how to keep LiveLink Face from overheating your phone. If you've been using it to animate characters like me, you know that uh, LiveLink Face makes your phone get pretty hot and eventually causes it to throttle back to 30 Hz, which isn't as good for animation. Well, the device you're looking at on the screen right now will solve that problem for you. It's just a standard phone cooler like you can buy for gaming, and I've attached it to my phone with another phone clip below it to hold the phone up in the right position for recording. This isn't just a fan, it's actually a thermoelectric refrigerator that can get your phone down well below room temperature. Even with Live Link Face running continuously, the phone will stay cool, but it won't get too cold, which could damage your battery. So this makes it much safer than using things like ice packs from the freezer. You can get these for under $50, and they come in different versions with either clamp or magnetic mounts depending on how new a phone you have. I'll put a link to this one in the video description, but any model should work fine. If you're using a head rig, you may still be able to find a cooler that will fit. But if you don't want the extra weight on your head, just put your phone in the cooler and let it chill down before you use it. By starting cold, your phone will take longer to overheat. This may seem like a pretty obvious idea, but so far I've not seen anyone using it, so I thought I'd tell you about it. Hope you found it useful. See you next time.